Well, that is curious. I just opened up the game and look what I found. Ottoman separatists at 100% in four provinces. Well, you all know what that means. Let's get our army maintenance back up. We're almost at our full reinforced, so that's always good to see. These ones aren't as important, but here we are. Ottoman separatists, 34. Holy crap, maybe it was a good idea to maybe um, pay it down, but all right. Anyway, I recently updated to Windows 10, hopefully hoping that this would not happen, but it seems to be a bit more jittery now. Well, we'll see what happens. Raise the forts around them, might as well. Keep them contained. I'm well aware that I can westernize, my dear boy. I'm well aware. But I'm more interested in this. The vocab shock isn't exactly that amazing. Yes, yes, yes. Your odds with you, Malmadukes and Kilwa. Alright. And Kilwa is nothing. They're just gone. <laughs> Persia still has their army stuck. Also nice to see. Afghanistan vote. Oh, Persia has... Multan and Shirvan. I'm still pretty sure that Shirvan would still not help out. We'll keep Britain in our confidence. Hmm. We are no longer considered a rival. How wonderful. No, Shirvan would help Persia, which is a shame. God, that border gore is disgusting. Riga, well done. Also Trevier as well. This area of the world is completely different. But not complaining about that necessarily. Not at all. Let's put our troops into some lands that we can actually use. Dry lands are here, which means I'll probably send you actually into here so we can double prong them. I think that's the technical term. Or more so the hammer and anvil. But yeah, we should win that one nicely. Should win that one nicely, I said. Good. Good. Oh dear. We lost so many troops on that one. Uh, this is why rebels are terrible. Alright, just lower all our forts. No big deal. Uh, our natural scientist died. Oh my god, this one would be beautiful. Yes, bring down that inflation. Interest is actually quite big. Hmm. Alright, pull it back down. Lose piety or gain I will gain some manpower actually. I can't I can deal with losing a bit of piety for that. These conversions go quickly now anyway. Did any of them go into... No, we didn't. That's all this land, presumably. Which is definitely not a bad thing. How about if I attack you, Shervan? Our uh, alliance. We're allies, that's right. I've got pesky allies. Blah. <clears throat> oh dear. I was playing a Victoria 2 game. Playing as Ethiopia, just conquered most of Egypt. But then I tried attacking them again, and the Ottomans had just finished the war of Egypt, taking back the cores they have here. And then they joined against me for no reason. It was just annoying, to be honest. Tunis is allied with Morocco. Eh, not quite the best alliance, I would have to say. Still, that means you couldn't gauge them if you wanted to, just take the coast. Do we want to? I don't know. Problem with that is it's all that Berber cost thing. Ugh. Plus 100 or was it plus 50? I forgot now. Ugh. Plus 100 or plus 50? 
50. Oh, it's not as bad as some other places in. So, can we do the thing yet? Where is it? Policies, policies, policies. No, that's not the right one. I'm gonna do this one. Yeah, just so we have it. Um, policies was in... I forgot what policies were, god darn it. I know where on the screen it is, where it's about here, but I don't know where... Oh, here we go. Yes, this one. This one's actually really good. It's a total of minus, what was it, 1.5? I think we agreed on? I don't remember, it was a while back, but it does lower your revolt risk massively. So where are these provinces? Mush. Where's Mush? Ah, uh, up here. Alright, we'll stick someone in there. The Kurds are coming back. Oh dear. Oh dear indeed. South is pretty much converted. Did they seriously just spawn? Oh my god. That is really quite annoying to be honest. Do you please win, please win, please win. Yes, 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 win! No! <laughs> Why? Why is this being done it to me? Why has this happened? Why has this happened to me? Alright, take this guy and send him right back. That was so close. That would have been so amazing as well. Just like, ah, you know. Not that big a deal. Rebels. Oh, great, they took the province. Okay, I can choose a new idea group. No idea what I'm going to do yet. We've finished one admin and one um, military, so that would be one of the two. What we do next, our air is terrible, yeah, we remember, I remember not paying for the advisor. Not the advisor, the, the doctor man, the doctor man. Though, I mean, it's going to have to be an uh, military tech, I think. Mm, that's coming down good. Quantity? I mean, our manpower does struggle, so I think quantity might be a good idea. We've already gone for defensive. Yeah, I think quantities are our best bet at the moment. Because we do struggle with manpower. Not always, but we have occasional moments where it's a bit dicey. Galleon and an early frigate. Yeah, let's convert the next few provinces. Oh, this is the one that would have been revolty. These guys are coming along slowly. 67, so six more years till you disappear. And we've renewed loans, which is a nuisance. I'll keep that up for now. Persia, what do we do about Persia? Ah, uh, Shirvan. We can always attack Cyprus again and do it that way. Crete is allied with the Knights and the Commonwealth. Neither of which are actually that amazing. We might just engage these guys and take them. Then take the Knights in the, s in the same war? Yeah, we could do that. It's good development, it's 24 and 33, so that's massive development, that would be amazing. And since our aggressive expansion is not at all affecting the Christians, that would do our only aggressive expansion in that direction. At least it should. And we're not planning to engage anybody up here just yet anyway. Although one question is, where, what state is that in? Um, areas... This is in Western Aegean region Balkans. Oh, that's part of here, isn't it? That's that, and that's this. 
Ugh, the states are gonna be such a waste, to be honest. Come on, down it goes. Wonderful. And we'll convert that one to... Uh, what do we do? What do we do? Shirvan would be a sure bet for pretty easy conquest. And we do have four F4 uh, relations. All of which are fine. We're attacking Tretzbond, Kazan, Trevier, and Fyodora. Tretzebond, uh, I mean. Let's see if we can't maybe sneak at a bit of a. Well, we're gonna sneak the thing from them, or we can, or we can let this line break. Uh, no, we'll keep it. We'll accept this. Then we'll head up and around. Get them a leader, which might be useful. 30,000, you can stick yourself up in here. It's a 10 stack. Would have quite liked the... Hmm. I'll stick our guys in here for now. Fyodora would be a good vassal to have and just grow into this area. But as long as I don't have to do anything in this war, I won't. There's no need for us to even be here in my opinion, but... Eh, Trevier has joined. But the balance of power is easily in our favor. I'm sure Persia will be happy to be a lapdog. Of course, it does release them from my prison. <laughs> Which is a shame, but what can you do? Oh, a fabricate claim on these guys anyhow. Just to see that it's there. Hmm. What I am interested in is that coast, though. It's, I've said it so many times now. But I mean, the problem is, is that Britain wants it as well. And with Britain coming around the coast so quickly, I think we're going to have to do it pretty soon, unless we want... Is that Britain too? It can't be. That would be ridiculous. Hmm. Anyway, what happened to improving relations with Britain? Did they ever go anywhere? That close are they? Maybe 58, yeah, a while away. What about France? Does France have any rivals that we might have? Nope. They also didn't get... Um, I saw that. I should have just retreated, shouldn't I? Ugh, bagger. Well, it is in the mountains, so... If someone had reinforced, we would have been fine. <laughs> now, we'll stick our forts up. I don't really care for this war. Rather prefer that Shervan doesn't grow much larger. Also, wow. Oh, that's Trevier, alright, of course. I was wondering who had that massive army, but that would make sense, I suppose. Should have just watched out, but I didn't have anybody in my way. Lower the maintenance again. Do you want to pay off these loans anytime soon? Speaking of money and loans and all that good stuff, have I given this to the merchant guilds I have? Alright, in that case... I'm gonna do this again. Oh, five years. Oh, that's a while. No need for us to do that then. Ulma. No need for that. Could do this if I wanted to. Ah, no, it's also a while away. Wow. Why are they <laughs> focusing on me so much? Alright, let's bring people up north and see if we have to deal with this nuisance. I don't know, they've, they've decided to change their interests. So who are we at war with? Ah, oh, Strevier, not Ryazan. I thought it was Ryazan that we were at war with. Alright. That makes sense, I suppose. That is Highlands, though, which is... 
I suppose, whatever. Oh, but my missionary's there. Jeez, I'm gonna have to throw him out because my missionary's there. Uh, I don't want to do all that again. Send our troops up. No, 98.6, are you mad? Get off. Get off my land. Oh, you're gonna win the siege, aren't you? You're gonna try and win that siege, you little bastard. Hmm. So we're gonna go for it. Well, I do suppose we do have half morale. Which makes it a lot more of a tempting target. Mmm. That is pretty bad. But I think we should win it. We do have more morale. And... Uh, it's gonna be a close one. But now that we have him pretty much... Wow, okay. So, that's bad. So, these next three rolls are going to make it very important, and since we rolled a zero, <laughs> a two, we're going to lose this fight, aren't we? <sighs> For Pete's sake. I was really hoping I didn't have to involve myself in this war. Right, these ones down here don't have to be raised just yet. How foolish of me, thinking I could not involve myself in a tiny war that Persia should actually be able to win. Damn. Alright, up they go again. Oh well. But 98.6, that is really infuriatingly close. But we'll have to see for now. You see, Persia now gets involved. If they do lose because they attack into the mountains. Uh, yeah, that's a loss. Hey mate, I might actually... How about I surrender? And I'll just break my lines of Shirvan. Yeah? It's a bit much money, actually. Eh, if, I, if you only made me break my lines of Shirvan, I would maybe accept. Kiva? Yeah, sure. They're still sieging down rebels. Soon we'll have to siege down a lot more than just rebels. And now Persia's claiming my land. Ugh, Persia, Persia, Persia. I should have just said no to this war. Hmm, Afghanistan was giving Persia troops. How interesting. These are mountains, so that would be a great place to put someone. I didn't win that, sadly. Keep him back. Hmm. Poor George is just seeing in the middle of it all. Slightly concerned about their living standards, or lack of at this point. Oof, that's terrible trade efficiency. What is with Persian attacking into mountains? Do they not know how this works? Red spawn is also mountains, so if we wanted to, we could probably siege that down relatively efficiently. Is Persia going to take it? They are going to take it. 
if they are a bit overzealous. <laughs> but that is the time right now, so thank you all for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time.